skills. And like I said before, today we are speaking the language of self-employment. And in studio with me is a youth educator and is here to talk about the same thing we have been talking about. You know, how you can organize yourselves and create employment for yourself. Karibu sana. Thank you. Kindly introduce yourself and tell us what you do. Oh, thank you. I'm Moses Barasa. Mm -hmm. I'm a peer educator. Mm -hmm. Coming from Busia County. All right. Karibu kwa studio. Yes, thank you. Mm -hmm. So what is the job of a youth educator? Yes. Mm -hmm. What is the job of a peer educator? Okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. The job of a peer educator mm -hmm. is to educate the young children, the young youths. Yes. Uh, we have youths in mm -hmm. various levels. Mm -hmm. those, uh, those that have just completed Form 4, mm -hmm. they are staying at home. Mm -hmm. Those that are uh, engaged themselves in border <coughs> and border border section, uh, we've realized that after Form 4, mm -hmm. you stay at home at about maybe for about two years, mm -hmm. just uh, waiting maybe for the decision from your parents. Yeah. You say, why should you be idle? Mm -hmm. You must be doing something. Mm -hmm. And having learned as a peer educator by the organization called ADEO, mm -hmm. I thought it wise that it's very important to exploit what I learned from the that organization. Yes. And I realized that uh, when I was going home, many of the youths were very idle. They were doing nothing, mm -hmm. just sitting around maybe at the market. Mm -hmm. uh, I thought that I think if they continue like this, we might have a lot of maybe crime rates mm -hmm. increasing. Yeah. And also the poverty level was increasing. Mm -hmm. And many of the youths were looking upon their parents to buy for them basic things. Yes. So I said no. Let me buy let me sell this information to these mm -hmm. young children. Mm -hmm. So early two thousand and five I formed a group mm -hmm. called Weyete Organization. Mm -hmm. Called? Uh, pardon? Weyete. Mm -hmm. Weyete in English means assisting yourself. Mm -hmm. So we came up with about 20 members. Mm -hmm. I talked to young them. Young people. Young people. Mm -hmm. and we also say that we cannot work young people alone. We need also to engage the, our elders also. Yes. That's our mothers mm -hmm. in doing, giving us moral support. So we also involved the mothers in that organization to support. Mm -hmm. And one of the things that we did was to come up with a, an economical project. Mm -hmm. And we started the uh, table banking, mm -hmm. collecting some few coins after two weeks. Mm -hmm. uh, after two weeks, we meet. Then actually this money accumulated yeah. for some time. Mm -hmm. so after we about a period of what time? Uh, for about now, one year. Mm -hmm. uh, so you, you, collect, you collect the money for a whole year? Yeah, we bank after, after two weeks, mm -hmm. we meet. Mm -hmm. And we say, what do we do now about with this money? Mm -hmm. So members decided to buy uh, one of a cow. Mm -hmm. And as I'm talking now, uh, we have about 20 animals. Mm -hmm. From 2005? From, from 2005. Mm -hmm. Because we looked at our mothers, they were not able. Mm -hmm. And the youths were actually just um, sitting idle. Mm -hmm. Now from there, many of the youths have even bought uh, motorcycles. Yeah. They are doing very well. Mm -hmm. And, uh, so uh, uh, let me cut you short. For this group that you have 20 animals with, yes, it's about the, the, the members who are in this group. Yes. What age are they? Age. Mm -hmm. Actually, from 20, 2005, mm -hmm. uh, we've been trying to, you see, other youths, they get some opportunities yeah. to go and train. Mm -hmm. We recruit others mm -hmm. to fill that uh, okay. the, the gap. Mm -hmm. So, so far, we have 25 members. Mm -hmm. And still, whatever they are, they are still contributing because they are still members. Yes. Whatever they are. Mm -hmm. And uh, I'm telling you right now, when you go there, mm -hmm. uh, the poverty level has gone down. Yes. Ah, if you have uh, 20 animals, then Yes. Uh, at the end of the day, we collect what you are getting, mm -hmm. that's milk. Mm -hmm. And then, after a period of time, mm -hmm. we give one of the calf that has uh, gone at, some, at, at least, we give to another member. Mm -hmm. That's how we distribute those animals. Okay. Uh, we, we said now we cannot have only one group. Mm -hmm. We went further and also looked at the border border sec uh, sector. Yeah. Uh, we came to realize that some of them were being maybe hiring the, this motorcycle. Mm -hmm. And then uh, you say you are given maybe 500 shillings. But the owner says, you give me 300 shillings. Mm -hmm. So we said, what do we do with these 200 shillings? Mm -hmm. Can you do something? Yeah. So we also took an initiative of educating them. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So right now, when you go to a border border home, mm -hmm. you can be surprised. It's mm -hmm. better than somebody who is in Nairobi here, mm -hmm. who is earning 30,000. Mm -hmm. And when you look at what he's doing, 
you cannot even compare with the border border. Yeah. This border border is well, mm -hmm. he has educated his children. Yes. Yeah, he's able, he's stable mm -hmm. because we offered the knowledge. Yeah. And uh, I said that if this country surely mm -hmm. realizes the potential that the youth have, yeah, it's a lot. The, this country will grow very fast. Mm -hmm. And that's why I say that I chose mm -hmm. to come here mm -hmm. so that I educate the young children who are there that we have opportunities, yeah. not just come in Nairobi. Mm -hmm. At home we have opportunities. Mm -hmm. If only, <laughs> if only mm -hmm. you sacrifice to work with others. Mm -hmm. If you sacrifice to work with others and we have various ideas, yeah. those ideas we bring them to the table mm -hmm. and then we now make it them now practical. Mm -hmm. yes. So now you have two groups. We have five groups. So you, far. you have five groups? Yes. Oh, that's yes. nice. We so the first one is doing, um, is working on... That's dairy. Yeah, dairy. Uh -huh. We have Makaka mm -hmm. Youth Group. Mm -hmm. we also what, have do that, what do those ones do? A Makaka Youth Group is another group in another sub-location. Mm -hmm. There's a youth group. Yeah. Uh, they are doing... Uh, uh, doing fire, fire that's the horticultural mm -hmm. planting of skumawiki, tomatoes, yeah. okay. and selling them across. You see, we are mm -hmm. at the border, yes. Uh, so, we take them to Uganda. Mm -hmm. You there in nice. excess. Mm -hmm. So, we have Fanyakazi BD, mm -hmm. it's another one also. Mm -hmm. What that's do those ones do? Yeah, what because those we say in every part we must have a group, we cannot come all of us all together, yeah, so that we go and sell this idea mm -hmm. to what they are doing. So we distribute some of our members to go, they go to the other groups yeah. to educate them on okay. what we are doing. Yeah. We also what have do Fanyakazi do? Fanyakazi group, this is a group which is dealing with the, we have some of the boys, uh, the youth that we have employed mm -hmm. to be doing business uh, like the Kinyosi. Oh, okay. Yeah. 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 Yes. Uh -huh. The next so, one? Yeah. We have mm -hmm. another one called um, Tusaidiani, or the mm -hmm. Youth Group. Okay. And from another, we have about four sublocations mm -hmm. in the world. Mm -hmm. So those ones are also dealing with the this one I've engaged in selling of cereals. Mm -hmm. Yes. All right. Yes. That's nice. Yeah. So in each each group has about how many members? Uh, each group has about uh, minimum is twenty. Uh huh. Minimum is twenty. Yeah, the highest has got twenty five. Okay. Which is the uh, Makaka Youth Group. Uh huh. Yes. So if you're that far, what about people who are in Nairobi or other other counties? How can you reach out to those people? Yeah, through this program. Because what you're doing is something good, and people are making money out of it. Uh, through this program, mm -hmm. because you cannot be known mm -hmm. if you don't have that kind of uh, an opportunity. Mm -hmm. I know many people are watching this program, mm -hmm. and I think they will be able to know what you are doing. Yes. Uh, I'll be able to give my number mm -hmm. at the end of the mm -hmm. program. Mm -hmm. So, I want to appeal to the young people, mm -hmm. whatever they are, that they should not depend on the political people. Mm -hmm. You see, many of the youths are being used in the wrong way. Yeah. Such that if you want, if, if you are talking about crime, mm -hmm. you are talking about the youths. Mm -hmm. You are talking about poverty. Mm -hmm. You are talking about the youths. Mm -hmm. uh, our neighboring county now, that was in Matungu, you had uh, people killing each other. Yes. And when you, you make the statistics, you realize that the people that were involved are the youth. The young youths, people. Not the, the old people. Yeah. Yeah, because they can they are, they are they have the energy yeah. which is being wasteful yeah, yeah. and they are getting paid little money to and do that bad money things. cannot help them yeah yes uh -huh. so it's also a way of killing crime yes mm -hmm. so my intention is to fight to one as a peace educator mm -hmm. i know we are talking about peace you must empower people yeah we talk about peace awareness we talk about innovativeness that's ideas mm -hmm. that if you have an idea that can help the society, mm -hmm. please let the society benefit. Mm -hmm. And I appeal to the whole country that they should be able to tap the, 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 the ability yeah, the, the potential young people. they have. Yeah, young people have so much They have potential. so many things to do. Yeah. Go to these industries like hotel. Mm -hmm. The people who are working there are youths. Yes. In every field, mm -hmm. they are the youths. Yes. But they should be made productive. Mm -hmm. And I appeal to even the people from the grassroots, mm -hmm. like the world alternatives. You see, youths must be powerful, yeah. must be engaged, mm -hmm. must play in what we call political uh, uh, public participation. Yeah. They should be the decision maker. They, make, they should make a decision mm -hmm. and should be part and parcel in mm -hmm. terms of uh, identifying some of the projects they think 
are essential yeah, for, for them, them yes. for their society. Mm -hmm. Not that somebody comes with a project that's not is not a basic thing for them. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So it sh it should be something that can be done. Exactly. Not something that is over the top that is not exactly, unrealistic. Exactly. That's what I mean. Okay. Yes. So would you mind sharing your number so that maybe if someone would like to be part of part yeah. of your teams? Thank you. Yes. My number is zero seven one three. Nine three eight seven eight two. You can also email Moses Barasa zero 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 one at gmail dot com. Mm -hmm. Yes. So yes, thank you so much for making time to be with and telling the young people that there are so many things that can be done out there. Not just you finish school, you get your degree, and you tamak the whole year looking for employment. Thank yeah, you. you should tap into that, into what, into the creative ideas you have. Thank you. Yeah. Today it's all about making, making people aware that you can do something on your own. So we are about to wind up, but um, don't you go anywhere. We are taking a short musical break and we'll be back with more of the A-Circuit.